Okay, Pop Pickers, uh, we're starting off with a uh, Windows XP, which is one of the most um, stable systems I've ever used. Uh, there it is, Windows XP. And what we're going to do is plug the Alasis Q25 into uh, XP and basically use it um, as an electric organ. Here's our keyboard and this is what we do. Okay so first thing to do is going to be to connect the um, USB lead to the Q25 and I can do that like that so this sort of squarish uh, squarish type plug goes into the socket there okay like that and then the next thing to do is to connect the keyboard to XP now as soon as you plug the USB into XP. Now when you first um, when you first connect the Q25 to XP um, you'll get a little icon come up you get a little icon come up down on this side which will tell you that XP has recognized Q25 and then it will tell you that it has installed it and you must wait a few minutes for that to happen and to be properly installed and then you're fine okay so We've downloaded um, Mixcraft 4, which is a, uh, a good program. Which is a good program for um, XP because it's not too large and XP can handle it really, really easily. Um, the later programs are larger and so require more space and so forth um, so we've downloaded Mixcraft 4 and uh, we're going to open it our keyboard is already connected you must always connect the keyboard before you open the software that's, uh, that, that's quite important so we're going to open Mixcraft 4 and it opens like this you've got three panels to choose from um, this is for live recording this is for things like uh, drum machines and this is for MIDI instruments the Q25 is a MIDI instrument even though we're going to use it as a live instrument um, so we go for MIDI
and it's opened us a virtual instrument track which is like a, uh, a, a, a another name for MIDI and in fact as soon as you um, as soon as you open it up um, it gives you a basic piano sound this is going through speakers which are here so in effect we're using the Alasis we're using the Alasis um, as an electronic analog so you can use that um, you can use it as an analog instrument there are other things you can do as well I mean you can you can turn it into an electric organ which is quite good for um, rock and roll and this is what we're going to do now and you will see that uh, it couldn't be easier really so we go to this panel here We go to this panel here and click once. Let's do it again just for demonstration. So we go to this panel here and click once and then you get a range of things you can choose from. And I'm going to scroll down to organ is here I'm going to click on organ and then it gives us a whole range of different type different types of um, organ sounds to use uh, I'm going to use something called freedom rock organ there we are okay and then a photo comes up just to um, confirm the sound I've chosen. I can close that now and now I'm going to get a completely different effect. different effect you get an organ effect So you can use the K 
as an analog instrument without actually recording directly through the software and it's uh, it's very easy to do it's not perfect but it's a um, it's a workaround to turn the Alasis MIDI keyboard into an analog instrument just like an old-fashioned electric organ in fact Thank mm -hmm. you.